I've been very impressed with uh, the Ukrainian people. We felt welcome from the time we stepped off the plane, especially from the FCA staff here in Ukraine. It's extremely encouraging to uh, me as an FCA staff in the United States to be reminded that we serve the same God, that Jesus died for the sins of everyone, whether you live in the United States, the Ukraine, or elsewhere. And what happens when you put your faith in Christ is you become a new, well, you become a new creation and you start showing love to one another. And that's what the Ukrainian staff have done for us. Um, they've just welcomed us. The athletes have been very receptive uh, to us. Personally, I got a chance to work with uh, baseball players here in Ukraine. And there were some differences, but there were a lot of similarities. I would say there's more similarities than differences. The only difference is the, you know, the equipment and the fields. It's the only difference. But fastballs are fastballs, curveballs are curveballs, and teammates are teammates. And they give full effort. They're very coachable, as RJ said here. That's been a pleasure. And they smile, they laugh, they play the game the right way. Um, one of the things that I've really loved is just learning about new food. And we've, we've, we've been trying new things. Our favorite within the FCA staff is borscht. Uh, if I'm saying that right, some yummy, yummy soup. Um, but mostly just, we love the hearts of the Ukraine FCA staff. They have a huge vision. And they're somebody we want to support. And we, we believe that God's going to honor their vision. 80,000 coaches receiving a Bible, receiving a touch from FCA, hearing about Christ. We want to get behind it, and we're going to support them. And we just love and appreciate all the Ukraine staff, um, athletes, and coaches. And we want to encourage you to, to keep living for Christ.